And welcome back everybody. It's been a blustery day here across South Mississippi. We're into the 60s right now. This is Jones College 66 degrees, a beautiful afternoon. It's definitely been pretty chilly out there. Winds are out of the north at 14, gusting to 18 miles per hour, and we're seeing winds up to 14 miles per hour up at Laurel Ford. Old Glory still flying proudly this afternoon. As you can see, the wind has it standing straight out there on the flagpole. Traffic pretty smooth, moving smoothly there on uh, Highway 15 and all across the region. We're seeing those winds remaining elevated, so we're seeing gusts anywhere from about 10 to 20 miles an hour all across South Mississippi. But those winds will begin to come down within the next couple of hours. Once we start to see the sunset, those winds will relax and we'll get they'll become pretty light during the overnight hours. Currently, we're into the 60s, 67 in Petal, 67 in Seminary, 64 in Oak Grove, 65 in Purvis and 66 in Beaumont. The rest of this evening will be Fine. We're going to see clear skies, but you're going to need a jacket if you're doing anything outside this evening. Temperatures are going to fall fast from the 60s down into the 50s. And when you wake up tomorrow morning, we're still talking upper 30s across a good chunk of South Mississippi. So it's definitely going to be pretty cold as we sort off your morning. Some of those more outlying areas away from town, the more rural areas, especially if you're in like a little bit of a dip or valley. You may get a degree or two colder than what's showing up here on the map, but you get the idea. It's going to be cold. And the last time we had 30s here in South Mississippi, you got to go all the way back to March 29th. That was the last time uh, we observed 30s down in our area. Ironically, that temperature was right around 39 degrees on that morning. But even though we start off cool tomorrow, we quickly warm up. We'll make it back up into the mid 60s by lunchtime, upper 60s to right at 70 degrees for your afternoon high tomorrow. So it's going to be a little bit warmer for your day on Thursday. The winds will be a little bit more relaxed too. And we're going to start to notice that warming trend over the next couple of days. We'll go from the 70s all the way up into the 80s by Sunday. And by next Monday, we're back up into the low 80s. So this is just going to be a quick cool down. It does not last forever, but at least we're going to be bright and sunny if you got to do anything this weekend. And uh, it's looking pretty nice out there as well. And you're even going to see our overnight lows begin to warm back up after tonight. So tonight will be our coldest night, and then those lows will begin to slowly warm back up. As you can see here in your weekend forecast, temperatures will make it back up into the mid to upper 40s. The only thing missing in our forecast, rain chances. And as I take through our future cast nothing to show you. We just stay completely quiet across our area. We begin to warm up a little bit next week as the winds switch and become more southerly, but it has really no other impact on our forecast. We're going to stay dry. We're going to stay sunny, not a cloud in sight over the next seven days. So this right here is the quietest that I can tell you our pattern is.